Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Amanda, I've got two kids. I have a little boy named Brody who is three, and then I have a little girl named Addison who is one. So today I'm gonna to be sharing with you fall clothing haul for a baby girl or toddler girl. It's really tricky. I don't know if I'm supposed to consider my daughter a toddler or a baby, because toddler is technically once they're like toddling around and walking, which she is not walking yet. So I still think of her as like a baby girl. So I don't know, toddler girl, baby girl. It's like, could be either, either one. <laughs> if you are new to my channel, I would love it if you would hit that subscribe button and join my community here on YouTube. I post all kinds of vlogs, mommy content, lifestyle content, and just fun stuff all together. So if that's something you're interested in, please hit that subscribe button. And if you're excited to see all of the clothes I picked up for my little girl, give this video a thumbs up and let's jump into it. Okay, where do I even wanna start? There's so much cute stuff sitting in front of me that I'm so pumped about. I've been gathering things for this video for a while. And so anyways, I'm super pumped. Girl clothes are just so much fun. It's like, oh, it's, I love having a girl, it's a blast. I love having a boy too, but girl clothes are like just beyond fun, it's crazy. Um, okay, I think like how when I did my fall like toddler boy clothing haul, um, I started with Target stuff, cause like I said, duh, Target is amazing. I think I'm gonna start with Target stuff here too. And if you didn't see that video and you have a toddler boy, I will link it up in the cards and in the description so you can check that video out as well. So, okay, let's start with Target. So I'm really sad actually because one of my absolute favorite things that I bought for Addison from Target, um, she wore it one time and then I washed it and when I pulled it out of the washer, I hadn't even dried it yet, when I pulled it out of the washer, the sleeve had a hole like that big and so I was so sad. So the other day I returned it and they did not have another one in her size. So I've already ordered that online but it's not here yet. So I'm gonna insert a picture here of the absolute cutest little girl sweatshirt you have ever seen. It is like a blush pink, as you can see in the picture, it's like a blush pink. Um, it's got like multiple colors, like color blocked. It's mauve it is a like faux fur sweatshirt, and it is like the absolute softest sweatshirt you've ever felt. It is by the brand Art Class, and she wears size, um, well, she wears an 18 month is what I got her in that sweatshirt. Um, and it fit her really good. The sleeves are like slightly long, so it's perfect because she can just wear it for the whole season. But it's literally the cutest little girl sweatshirt I think of all time. So if you have a little girl and you like blush pink, I would highly recommend getting it. Um, so yeah, I'm just so bummed that they didn't have it in stock when I went to like exchange it. And it must have just been defective. I don't think it's like a quality thing. I don't know. Maybe we'll see the next time around when I get the other one, but it's that was like one of my favorite things out of like the whole haul. So I'm sad that it's not here for the video, but I just kept waiting on items and I was like, okay, I can't wait any longer. It's already fall, I've gotta get this done. So that is the first thing that I'm obsessed with. And um, yeah, the next thing that I got her is this really pretty sweater. It's an ivory sweater. And this is also the art class brand, but I got her 12 month in this. And I don't know, like I, I feel like this brand, some of the things like, I don't always feel like it's super consistent in terms of like sizing being the same. So like I said, this is 12 month and the sleeves are long. Like I have to roll the sleeves on her. Whereas that 18 month sweatshirt like fits her perfectly. The sleeves are just barely long. It's kind of weird. Like it's that one almost fits more like this 12 month size. So, um, yes, yeah, so that's a little weird. Like the consistency between sizes among this brand seems a little odd to me, but this is the most precious sweater. The little like fringe on the sleeve. Like I am all about the fringe. If you've been watching my channel for a while, I'm obsessed with fringe and tassels and like boho vibes. And I saw this and I was just like, she has to have it. She just does. So, um, it is so cute. Just a pretty ivory sweater with, three little buttons. When she's worn it, she has worn it a couple times and I don't always button it. It looks cute unbuttoned as well. So this is just a really good staple um, that could really match anything for um, their little outfits. And I love getting things like this that are like versatile that will go with a lot of things, um, especially with like jackets or like outerwear things for babies. 
and toddlers because I don't know you just don't in my opinion like I don't want to buy her like four different jackets especially we live in Texas and it's not cold for that long so um, I like finding things that will kind of go with her whole wardrobe next is something I got a long time ago for her um, it was basically as soon as the season was shifting and I was like I saw this and I was like this is gonna go fast so I had to pick it up for her and it's this beautiful blush sweater dress and I got her 12 month size in this um, it's the brand is just one you made by Carter's so it is just the perfect color pink I am obsessed and like it comes with little bloomers as well but honestly she'll probably wear this with some like tights and some like cute boots or moccasins or something like that so I just think this is so cute and I almost put it on her for church um, today but then I really didn't have tights so I need to get her some tights but I'm just obsessed next I got her this basic black it's kind of like a waffle knit little shirt and it's so cute this was like a really good basic the sleeve is cute it's got like a little bow and they had these in multiple colors this is the brand cat and jack i got her 18 month size and it was ten dollars and she hasn't worn it yet um i've been trying to save some of this stuff but anyways it's so cute and so soft like i feel like this is gonna be a great like basic to throw on her and they had like a beigey like oatmeal color which i liked but they didn't have her size and then they had, and I think that one was a little different. It was more like tunicky, like a little longer with like kind of a flare at the bottom. And then they had kind of a burgundy color. So, um, but I love black and I just really liked this. So super cute. And then these two things she actually got as a gift for her birthday. Um, but I was obsessed with them and I wanted to include it in this um, since it's for fall. So she got these Cat and Jack jeggings. They are 18 month size. They're black. And they're just like skinny jeans, basically. Not really jeggings, they're like skinny jeans. They say super stretch. Oh, they call it a jegging, okay. And then on the inside, they do have the little adjustable buttons. Um, and these fit her great, and they're just so cute. I love them. And so like this, with this like black top would be so cute. With the sweater, with all kinds, I mean, black jeans go with everything. But then they, she also got this adorable, look at how cute this is. It's just like a little, what do you even call this because it's not like I mean it would go over like a long sleeve shirt but it's just like army green leopard and I love it it's 12 month size this is art class brand and I just thought this was like the cutest thing ever and so yeah moving on I'm gonna move on to Old Navy show you all this stuff okay so these are brace yourself these are the world's cutest pajamas for toddler girl baby girl I don't know whatever you want to call it <laughs> what do I call her let me know in the comments is she a toddler yet even though she's like because she's 14 months but she doesn't walk so maybe she's not I don't know okay check these pajamas out oh my gosh they are like a blush pink leopard leopard is like the thing right now for fall it is like everywhere and I love it I'm like totally into it so when I saw these blush pink pajamas I was like uh 100 she has to have these they're so stinking cute. Um, so in this, I got her 18 to 24 month size. I always go up in pajamas. She's technically like 12 to 18 months right now, but pajamas shrink and I like for them to be comfy. I always say these things, but I have to reiterate. I go up a size because they shrink so bad, the cotton ones specifically. They need to be comfy and they last longer. So it doesn't really matter if they get a little bit faded out and stuff like that, whereas they're nicer clothes. I don't know you just want them to like fit nicely not look like they're wearing like clothes that are two sizes too big you know so world's cutest baby girl pajamas go get some next she got this adorable jean jacket this was actually a gift from her birthday as well but it is so cute she had this same jacket in like zero to three month size when she was like a young baby and i was obsessed with it i just thought it was so stylish and cute and i could wear my light denim jacket we could be twins and I just loved it. So I was really excited that she got this and it fits her perfectly. And then she got a couple pairs of little like leggings. She has a black pair and a little denim pair. 
perfect staples you always need things like this as i'm looking through all this i'm like okay she really needs some like more jeans i probably or like pants she mostly has tops here so that's like mental note need to like do that next she has this cute little like sweatsuit this is like so cute it's burgundy uh it says bu 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 so cute um so that one and then the little pants that go with it so cute right little joggers I love sets like this. They're so comfy, especially like during the day when we're home. They can just be like comfy and cozy and like not be all dressed up, you know? Next are a couple of t-shirts. Look at how precious this one is. It is just a burgundy t-shirt. Look at the little ruffle on the sleeve. So cute, little white hearts. I love these things like from Old Navy, these little basic t-shirts and stuff because you can get them on sale for like $6 or whatever and they're just perfect little play clothes. And yeah, so cute. I love all their little patterns. So that one's really cute with the hearts. This one I'm obsessed with too. It's like leopard with the blush pink in the center of the spot. So cute, right? And then this little thermal. It's like a little floral print, but it's like a blush, like a mauvey blush and army green, which I love. So really cute little basics. And then I got her a pack of socks. These are like blush pink, they're super soft. These are perfect like for winter, just like to wear with boots, stuff like that. Okay. And then check these out. These are like the score from Old Navy. Look at these boots. Do you die? I die. Y'all ever watch Rachel Zoe back in the day? She's like a stylist, the stars. I was obsessed with her. And she had like a reality show. She always be like, I die. And I die over these boots. They're so cute. So anyways, these are a size five from Old Navy and they're slightly like just barely too big so she can kind of grow into them. But that's the smallest size in like toddler shoes at Old Navy. So we made them work because they are just absolutely precious. But since she is still crawling, she's like scuffing up the toe. I'm like, girl, start walking. Okay, so while we are on the shoe train, I'm gonna show you the cutest moccasins ever. If you saw my most recent day in the life vlog, I actually went to Nordstrom to exchange these because she got them for her birthday and they were like massive on her. They run very big, just FYI. And um, Nordstrom's amazing with their returns and exchanges and so they're already here. They got here so fast and they're so cute. So they are these little Minnetonka moccasins and Initially, I got her a size five, and um, I just thought that that made logical sense. On their website, on Nordstrom's site, it says five is 12 to 18 months. So that's the size that she got, and that is not accurate. They literally are huge. They would fit a three-year-old. So they were like so much bigger than these. And so we swapped them for a size three, and so they are perfect. They're a little big on her, so she can wear them with socks and just kind of grow into them, which would be great. And she can wear these like in spring too, so it's not like only a winter thing. So it's actually nice that they're like a little bigger. But look at these little boots. They are so cute. They're just like this brown suede, kind of has, so this is considered an infant shoe, so even though she is gonna start walking, um, that was what would confuse me about the site because like the walking sizes started as size five, um, but like I said, it, it was so huge. I don't know what little girl who's like just starting to walk at one would fit in those, they, they wouldn't. So if you're gonna consider getting these, just remember that that size chart is like not really accurate, so. Anyways, I just love these. They're pretty, they're really affordable. They're not crazy. I want to say they're like $25, um, even though they're like, I mean, I have Minnetonka moccasins that I love. I've worn them for years. And so they're really like high quality. They're so soft. Um, and it's nice to get something nice like that every now and then. And especially if it doesn't like break the bank for a baby because they grow so fast, you know? So anyways, super excited about those. And then I'm gonna show you, while we're, I guess, on like accessory type things, shoes and stuff, um, Addison got some new bows. And these, in my opinion, are like the cutest baby bows that she has ever had. And she's had baby bling bows and she's had all kinds of brands. And um, these are my absolute favorite. 
so the the company it's a small shop and i'll link their instagram below so you can check them out the company is everly blake bows and they are so cute so she has now she got like a little let me start with this a little ivory and i love the texture of these and just how big and fluffy they are they're so soft very high quality bows um and then she got more of a white color that has like a silver um stripe through it stripe if that's what you want to call it anyway really really cute they just look i love the size of them because they're just bigger so they're like perfect on her head and if um if you don't know addison when she was wearing the baby bling bows they're thicker and so they go over her ears and she rips them down now immediately and so i had to find like a skinnier bow that would go behind her ear and not bother her so these are perfect she leaves them on her head and they're just so cute and then she got this like mauve blush color, which I love. And then this lighter pink blush color. It's more of a baby pink. So you can see the difference in the pinks there. And they are just so, so cute. So I highly recommend these bows and you checking this company out. They are just absolutely precious. All right, and we are coming up on the final stuff here. This shirt is just a really basic black t-shirt um, from Walmart, actually. I was there the other day, and I was like, oh, she needs like a long sleeve black t-shirt to wear under her little, whatever this is. Not really a vest, but I don't know. So I just picked her up. This was like $4. It's that Granimals brand, size 18 month, just a black t-shirt to wear under that. And then this is interesting. So normally, like, I'm not, like, Walmart's not my favorite store for sure. I'm Target all the way. But the other day I was there and I was like walking by the kids stuff and I saw some leopard and I was like, mm, let me go look. And so I walked over there and saw this. And I think if you're selective, like about the things that you pick up at Walmart, there's some cute stuff every now and then, but it's not like my favorite place for kids clothes, but every now and then you get lucky. So I thought this little set, this little sweatsuit set was so cute. Literally $4.48 for the top, $4.48 for the bottom. So inexpensive and so cute. So I got our 18 month size and it's kind of like leopard but then like little hearts too. It's like a metallic gold, blush pink and so cute. Um, it is like fleecy on the inside so it's warm. And then yeah, just the matching pants. I'll insert a picture um, of her over here wearing it and she just looks so cute so and she is wearing a baby bling bow in this picture and that was before she got her new bows so anyways i think these are cuter but um anyway so it's a cute little set and yeah good price so that is all of the stuff that i picked up for addison minus my favorite sweatshirt by the way you just saw my pants i was like hoping my pants wouldn't show it's just i couldn't put jeans on it's late and I'm like, I wanna be comfortable. So like, look how, don't be deceived, my cute flannel. This look is not, <laughs> not the cutest look, but anyway. Um, yeah, so I'm really excited about all of her stuff. So sad, my favorite sweatshirt for her is not here to show you guys cause it's like the cutest thing I've ever seen. But yeah i think we found some good stuff for her i love shopping for baby girls i think it's so much fun let me know in the comments like does shopping for girls or boys stress you out more i think boys are super easy i think girls are like i could get carried away very easily so i have to like keep it in check for sure so thank you guys so much for watching hopefully this gave you some good ideas for some things that you could pick up for your little girl if it did give it a thumbs up subscribe if you're new and i'll see you in the next video thanks for watching bye you can do better let me show you what a good time looks like you can do better